Wake up. Welcome back. Why don't you tell me about yesterday? Xixi. You know, it's the Chinese Valentine story. Oh, well, that's actually a very romantic story. <laughs> it's about two lovers who can't be together. Can I read it to you? Sure. There once was a beautiful princess. She could weave and sew anything together magically. But a lowly, common sheep herder fell in love with her. You look not too bad yourself. Not too bad for a teacher. A little something to remember the day by. You might want to hold on to that. Very well could be magic. Everything around me is not real to me. Yesterday, I was with Nick. Happy anniversary. Happy anniversary. But her mother was a goddess, and she forbade the two from being in love. And she created a vast river to keep them apart. These false memories are becoming dangerous, Lily. Tim suggests that we put her in a facility. If that's your decision... Well, he's in your head. He, he's a figment of your imagination! No, he's not! No, no, no! Sick! No, 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 Is this life so awful that you had to go make up some fairy tale world? Stay away from me! You're his mother, Lily. He's like a stranger to me. I really don't know what's going on with me. I don't remember any of this. What's wrong with mom? I found the ring. The ring Neil gave to me. But the magpies of the world, they felt sorry for the two. And so they created a bridge. Where the lovers could see one another. Perfect husband, an incredible son. That's what you hold on to. We had a life together. And then one day you wake up and you act like I'm some stranger. You can't plan everything. Sometimes you just have to follow your heart. Get through this together, okay? I remember our first date. I know you love me. I know you do. Wait, do you think I want any of this? Come on, you tell me what I can do. What's going on, Lily? 